So we'd like to say that we're uh, machine learning radically accessible. What that means is we're providing a, a platform that's giving much greater access to machine learning and artificial intelligence. No longer do you have to be just a data scientist or a mathematician to do machine learning and artificial intelligence. Part of our roadmap will make it even more accessible to a much larger audience. Having a platform that's much more accessible than what they're currently used to gives people a, a much easier way to get onto a platform to actually start doing their modeling. So as machine learning continues to grow, models from NVIDIA uh, and their platforms continue to become more accessible, you no longer have to custom create your solution anymore. So just like the auto industry used to have a coach builder, now you have you know, the Model T assembly line and now you can go order your Rivian and it will show up one day. And the same thing is going to be true of machine learning. It's going to be more about the application of machine learning in the future than it is about getting into the details of building it because we'll be building on top of layers of existing technology. In the future, we'll even go further with guided ML or guided machine learning where some of the students don't even have to be in a comp sci or computer science major to be able to do machine learning. So somebody could come onto NeuroThink, for instance, and they could choose a model that had already been developed, and they could work on the, the code of the model, or maybe they don't want to work on the code of the model. Then there's data sets. The data sets will provide libraries of data sets that will help them guide them through the right type of model with the right kind of data. Another part, though, of being radically accessible is being able to have AI ML in places all around the world. We've been in discussions with technology partners where they're trying to map the underwater ocean or they want to be on another planet. And their reliability of the machine learning is absolutely paramount. Or clean energy. Putting windmills all around the world takes a lot of interesting technology. These are the types of projects that we want to be involved in. The med tech space, the banking space. All these industries know that they need more advanced AI ML. We don't want just to be a machine learning as a service platform. We want to be even a community around data science. We want to be a big part of machine learning and artificial intelligence into the future, whether it be science organizations, enterprises, or individuals. Think of it as kind of like a cross between a Kaggle and a LinkedIn. We are also a fast-moving, innovative company. On our weekly calls with VMware, we already started to talk about different types of innovation that could be built into future releases of VMware. So I believe that artificial intelligence will just continue to really help enhance all of our jobs, not necessarily take away our jobs, but give us the ability to do the things we really love to do.